Hi guys, welcome back. This is another routine update thing that I do usually a couple of times in a month as soon as something comes up. So today we're going to see how you can do it again, but something is very important today. I'm going to show you guys how you can bypass the safety net check using the super SU. Yes, you heard it right. So prior to that, uh, we talked about a lot of times how you can do the same thing using the matches because you know uh, the matches was the only solution which can give you both the routing and the safety net check thing. So now in case you guys don't know what is safety net thing. so in simple way, uh, in case uh, you wanted to use such application which are only working on non rooted devices such as Android Pay, Snapchat and the Pokemon Go, in case you are still playing that, we can do the same with the safety net. So anyway guys, this is the thing, so Magis was pretty simple and in case you want to do the same with the Magis, so check the earlier video, I will have many videos in the links that you can use and install the Magis. So today is very important thing as I mentioned here, so the same I am going to show you guys using the Super SU, right here you can see my device is rooted perfectly and we are able to bypass the safety net check. So I am just showing you guys there is no matches at all right now. In case you're wondering, you can see there is no matches installed, and I have just only Super SU. So first, let's see what are those important conditions in case you're going to use Super SU hide feature to root your device and bypassing the safety net. Now these are the few important things that you must follow before this thing should work. I don't worry, I will tell you guys all the exact steps. So first things, you're gonna need a Super SU file which is uh, should be higher or at least 2.82 SR2 and this is the latest SU Hide version 1.06 just released yesterday and you should install Super SU using the SPIN board we'll talk about that later and along with that the minimum condition is that this thing will only work uh, with the Android version 6.0 and the above that is. it is not going to work on the Lollipop or the KitKat so starting from 6.0 till 7.1.2 it's going to work now I have not tested that on the Android or the prefer probably I will try in case you have that so be follow me on there I will show you guys later and along with that you should have the latest third version installed so you should have at least 3.0.2 and higher so I'm going to use this version 3.1.1 hyphen O for OnePlus 3T and same I have done for the OnePlus 3. So this is guys the four minimum condition that you should follow. Now let's start and see what are those steps how you can install this Super SU and do the safety net bypass check. So first step is to go inside this recovery mode that is inside the truck. So I am assuming you have to install 3.0.2 higher. So you can use any combination to go inside this truck. So once you are inside this truck, you have to go to this ATB shell execute and ATB shell command that you can do by going inside this advanced and terminal. So you have to type the exact same command and uh, be sure to type it correctly. Echo uh, bind as pin that is it's just creating a super SU folder dot super SU inside this data directory. So once it is done, you just have to click on this OK button. So it will just go to the next line that is cursor is going to the next line. Now go back to the directory where you have copied the super SU. So this is our location we have copied. So try to confirm flash once it is done perfectly. So it'll take a couple of seconds to install it. So once it is done, make sure to clear this wipe cache and Dalvik. And after that, it's important you should reboot your device first. After installing Super SU, once you have successfully rebooted your device, then you have to come back again inside this twerp. So here is I am again inside this twerp. Then you need to go inside the same directory where you have copied the SU hide file. So it's in the same location where I have Super SU. You just have to click here and just swipe to confirm flash. Once it is installed successfully. So you have to make sure to wipe uh, this cache and dialog. So once it is done, just reboot your device normally and go inside this Android as usual. Once you have installed the Super SU, if you go inside this app drawer, you can see there are two parallel instances of the Super SU. Right here one and the second here you can see there is a briefcase shortcut dot is there. Same for the SU hide. So this is actually uh, for the multi-user functionality. So the second one is only work once you go inside the setting and enable this feature uh, where it is as a enable multi user that means only the prime user has a root access so something it is very professional thing so I'm not going to get in much detail so this is how you can do that and I think very important thing uh, for you once you go here inside the setting you should make this grant access default access to grant by default because sometimes you know if you launch some application they are just stuck in getting the root privilege so this is something very recommended so let me give you guys a quick demo so here is how you can see I'll show you guys the Pokemon Go is working fine so now you can see guys Pokemon Go is working fine and my device is beside rooted too. So guys there you have it this is your uh, routing tutorial for update guide actually basically for all the Android users. So check the way and description if you want to do the same with the Magis Manager and also we have already seen the Super Resistance. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll talk to you very soon. Have a great day.